There is recent data that in certain postmenopausal women with small tumors, the whole breast need not be irradiated. In these cases, only the tumor site and the surrounding breast tissue needs to receive radiation. This is called accelerated partial breast irradiation or APBI. Accelerated partial breast irradiation can also allow the treatment time to be shortened from six weeks to about one week. The other benefits of this treatment is that the lung and heart receive only minimal radiation exposure. One way is to place thin tubes or catheters into the region of the biopsy cavity under ultrasound guidance. This is usually done with general anesthesia. This is called a breast implant or brachytherapy. These catheters stay in the breast for one week. A CAT scan will be used to calculate and plan the treatment. You will come to the radiation department twice a day. A tiny radioactive seed is inserted into each of the catheters, left there for a specified amount of time, and then retracted into a lead safe. The patient goes home after each treatment, wears a special bra to keep the catheters in place. The catheters are soft and flexible, like an intravenous catheter, and most women have only minimal discomfort with this treatment. Another form of brachytherapy is to insert a balloon catheter called a mammocyte into the tumor bed after the surgery. This device consists of a balloon that can be inflated to fill the cavity. Again, the patient comes into the radiation department twice a day. A radioactive seed with a steel cable is inserted into the balloon, left for a few minutes, and then retracted into a lead safe. While this treatment is technically easier, Fewer women are good candidates, and there is less data with this form of treatment. Don't think there's going to be much As mentioned before, either treatment with an implant or the mammocyte takes only one week compared to five to seven weeks with external beam irradiation. Okay. There is also active work using external beam irradiation to treat only part of the breast. This has been done using CAT scans to image the breast anatomy and the region at risk. Computers can help us aim multiple small beams just to the region of the breast while minimizing the amount of radiation to normal structures. Your doctor will advise you if these are treatment options for your breast cancer. Other new technical advances include respiratory gating and intensity modulated radiation therapy or IMRT. Respiratory gating times radiation delivery to your breathing pattern. IMRT allows the radiation beam to be adjusted in a special way to more evenly deliver the dose of radiation. Both of these techniques could be very helpful in selected patients.